Welcome. In today's math lecture, we're going to talk about how to cost out a recipe. We're going to have ingredients. Uh, we're going to scale the recipe up, and then we're going to figure out the cost of what they are. So uh, if you were going to make a recipe of something, and you need to make more than what the recipe called for, we're going to do that. And then how much will it cost to make the final recipe? And then figure everything up. So for this, we have shrimp and salmon cakes. Uh, the recipe calls serves six people or six servings. Um, we're going to make it to serve 60. So it's simply multiplying by 10. And we're going to have a food cost of 25%. Remember that. That'll come in later. All right. So the first ingredient we have here is two tablespoons of red onions. Um, one cup of red onions is about six and a half ounces. Okay. So two tablespoons times 10 is going to give us 20 tablespoons or 10 ounces or one and a half cups. Okay. Now the cost of the red onions um, is 88 cents a pound at the grocery store app, okay? 88 cents a pound. And there's an 89% yield on those onions. So when you're going to cut the onion up, you're going to get 89% of that onion, okay? So to figure out how much the onion is going to cost you, you're going to say 88 cents a pound divided by 89% yield to give you 99 cents per pound, okay, and there are 16 ounces in a pound, that's going to be 0 0.062 ounces, okay. We need 10 ounces, so we're going to take the 0 0.062 ounces, multiply it by 10 to get our total cost of 62 cents, okay. All of our costs are going to be written in 62 cents, all right. So, here we have one tablespoon of green bell pepper. One cup of bell peppers is about five ounces or so. Uh, one pepper itself weighs about five ounces. All right. So according to the um, what we need here, we need 10 tablespoons. We need five ounces or one cup of green bell pepper. All right, so we have a bell pepper that is 60 cents each, according to the, to the uh, grocery store app. It has an 82% yield. That's going to give us uh, 0 0.60 divided by 0.82 to give us roughly 73 cents each. Okay. So that's all we need is one, one bell pepper finely chopped, so that's 73 cents for that bell pepper, right? Now, when you go to the store, you actually have to buy two, but 73 cents, right? Two tablespoons of mayonnaise, right? Uh, 20 ounces of mayonnaise is what you need, right? 20 ounces uh, divided by two to get the number of fluid ounces that you need is 10 fluid ounces, and the mayonnaise jar is 248 for a 30 ounce jar. We take the 248 divided by the 30 ounces to give us 0 0.083 ounces. Multiply that times the 10 fluid ounces that you need and you have 83 cents for the mayonnaise. The Dijon mustard, right? You need one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. So when you figure up what you need for the 60, you need 10 tablespoons of mustard or five fluid ounces for the mustard. That mustard happens to be 92 cents for a 12 ounce bottle of mustard. You take the 12 ounce bottle of mustard, uh, the 92 cents divided by the 12 to get 0 0.077 uh, cost per ounce. Multiply that times your five fluid ounces that you need and you have 0.385 uh, for your ounces there is 0.39 is what it's going to cost you. Okay, you're going to round up. Remember, all of this is 
dollars and cents. Okay. Three tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce. So multiply it times 10, you get 30 tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce or 15 fluid ounces of Worcestershire sauce. Now, the bottle of Worcestershire sauce on the uh, shopping app is a dollar for a 10 ounce bottle. You're gonna need to get two bottles, but you're only gonna use half of the second one. So you need uh, $1 divided by the 10 to get 0.1 times your 15 fluid ounces. And that's gonna be a dollar 50 for the Worcestershire sauce. Four tablespoons of butter. You're gonna multiply that times 10 to get 40 tablespoons of butter, all right? One cup of butter is 16 tablespoons. So if you figure what one cup is, multiply that out, you're gonna need one and a fourth pounds of butter. According to the shopping app, the butter is 298 per pound. So 298 times your one and a quarter pounds is gonna give you $3.72. Uh, 3.725. You're going to round that up to 373. Okay, you have one pound of salmon fillets. Uh, so you need 10 pounds of salmon fillets. Salmon fillets, according to the shopping app, is 764 per pound. So you're going to multiply the 764 times 10 pounds to get $76.40, okay? By far the most expensive ingredient in the salmon and shrimp cakes, all right? 10 large shrimp, each shrimp is roughly half an ounce. It will vary according to shrimp and according to size per shrimp, but we're gonna round it up and say half an ounce. All right, so you need 10 large shrimp times 10, you need 100 large shrimp. Uh, each of them being half an ounce, we're going to say you need 50 ounces of shrimp. All right. Uh, on the shopping app, the shrimp is in 12 ounce bags. That's why I didn't figure this one down in pounds. All right. So it's 552 for a 12 ounce bag of large shrimp. All right. So 552 divided by 12 gives you 0.46 as a cost per ounce, okay? So 46 cents per ounce times the 50 gives you $23 even, all right? And then to pull everything together, you need some breadcrumbs. So one cup of breadcrumbs is uh, four ounces, all right? So one cup is four ounces, multiply that times 10. We need 40 ounces of breadcrumbs. 40 ounces of breadcrumbs is two and a half pounds, right? So $3.48 for a one pound bag of breadcrumbs. So we're gonna multiply the 348 times the 2.5 to get $8.70. Okay, now that we figured up all of our prices, all of our prices, our costs are in red. The onions are 62 cents. The bell peppers are 73 cents. The mayonnaise is 83 cents. The Dijon mustard is 39 cents. The Worcestershire sauce is $1.50. The butter is $3.73. The salmon is 76.40. The shrimp is $23. The breadcrumbs is $8.70. We add all of those ingredients up, and that's gonna give us a recipe total of 115.90, all right? And that's gonna make 60 shrimp and salmon cakes, all right? We take the 115.90, divide that by 60 to get a cost per portion of $1.94. $1.94, that's our cost per portion, all right? This is simply the food cost, not the preparation, not the utilities, not the plates, not the breakage, not the silverware, not the drinks, not anything else that goes with it. Simply the food cost for this 
uh, shrimp and salmon cake. Right. So a menu selling price for just a single shrimp and salmon cake. We take the dollar ninety four cost per portion. Remember when I said we were going to come back to the food cost? The food cost is 25%. All right? So 25%, 0.25, $1.94 divided by 0.25 gives us $7.76. Now, in the real world, we would round this up to uh, $7.95, $7.99, something along those lines. But for uh, $7.76, you could buy a single shrimp and salmon cake on a menu. I hope this helps y'all. Um, remember, always like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.